Once upon a time, these tricks were considered impossible, but Nitro Circus athlete and Las Vegas native Aaron Fotheringham, aka Wheels, has made a career of making it look easy. Honestly, the crowd really helps in those situations because you're thinking like, man, I could die. <laughs> like, and then that crowd just like pumps you up and you're just like, okay, I'm just gonna send it, you know? And that's when you end up pulling off tricks that you're like, dang, I thought that was impossible. It takes a certain type of person and a certain uh, wire in your brain to not only know you're gonna do something, know you're gonna fail, but then want to conquer it and achieve it. Fotheringham was born with spina bifida, which took away most of the use of his legs, causing him to use a wheelchair. But the last thing Wheels sees himself as is disabled. I feel like I just always had to find a way to do something and adapt, you know, and so the wheelchair has just been a tool to help me do stuff. And, you know, I can't ride a bike or a skateboard, so the wheelchair was honestly just the next thing. You've been doing this since you were a little kid. Were your parents ever concerned of you kind of starting this type of stuff? Yeah, I was pretty young when I first got into it. I was eight and, you know, my mom was pretty worried but um, my dad was like, no, just let him do it. Two years ago, UFC president Dana White bought through one sports and entertainment, the company that runs Nitro Circus and moved its HQ to Las Vegas. It's really cool to see because, you know, action sports doesn't always get that spotlight. And, you know, with Dana supporting it, it can only go up from there. Now, Wheels has had the chance to do his tricks in some of the biggest stages there is. He's also the first human to ever pull off a wheelchair backflip and a wheelchair double backflip. He tells me one of his secrets to success is to always look on the bright side of every situation life throws at you. It's easy to focus on the things that are making it difficult, but I feel like there's you know, twice as many things like in our lives that are helping us get to that point. Reporting in Las Vegas, I'm Johnny Resendez.